everybody. Well, especially for people in... Well, for everyone, I guess. Isn't yeah, it? it is. Everyone. It's for everyone. In so, the world. So, oh, Merry yeah. Christmas. Um, oh. This is a Christmas edition, as you can tell. Yes. And today, we will be doing another unboxing video. With Lilac and Floss. <laughs> oh, yeah, from our BS Akirino. Yes. So, this video, I was going to say this week, but this video is a, as I said, a Christmas edition. So there is a lot of pets to begin yes, with. Yes, there is a total of 16 pets, 8 pets each, which we used with our Christmas money that we got. Exactly. And it came in pretty fast. Yeah. Not as fast as <clears throat> our other one, because it's from the same seller, but still... Well, what was it, six days earlier than six the expected early. day? I'm pretty sure, something like that. Um, it was a total for, of $200 for both of us. No, yes, total yes. $200. Yes, yes, exactly. So, yeah, well, I guess we can get into it. Oh, and there might potentially be my new mascot. I'm thinking of changing like, to someone more like me as a person. Because I do see myself as lilac, but... This other pet that I'm buying is my dream pet. Oh my god. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, I think I'm making her mine. And same with me. Like, I'm thinking of changing <laughs> one too. I'm like so freaking excited because I have some dream pets in here. And oh my god. <gasps> and for a cheap price too. So I'm like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's get into it. Please. Ooh. Let's go. Let's go. Ah. Welcome, guys, to again our unboxing space. Yes. <laughs> that Which is, is like, carpet. Good old carpet. The camera's here. Carpet. <laughs> So this is our package. Hi. It's pretty goddamn massive. It's like we, huge. And we won't flip it. Like this is going to the LPS. Well, no. <laughs> no. Um, but this is the package. And we won't flip it over because it's got our details and we couldn't be bothered to um, scribble them out or rip them off because we're lazy. So we have e And because we literally came home from school and started filming because we are that excited. Because that, that look. Okay. okay. So this is our trusty. very trusty, very trusty sisters. And... Where should I start? Uh, this way. I think this way's got. So we'll start cutting. <laughs> That was the package open oh, unboxing, and now we will show you the, the what it came in. Yes. The pets. All right, so let's get into it. Let's get started with our pets. We've got a couple extras, so we'll start with them, which is really adorable. So I will start with my extra, which was this adorable little. Is it like a parakeet or something? So. Um, cockatiel, green or something. parakeet or cockatiel or whatever, and it's a pale lime green color with uh, aqua blue hair and yellow beak and yellow feet. Um, everything else is pretty bland about on its body, nothing else. Um, it's got blue and, well, look, two shades of blue eyes, and it's really cute. Um, there's no magnet or anything like that, but so adorable. Hello! But, um, yeah, we, I wasn't expecting this one, but regardless, it's cat. Yeah, I'll just put it back here for now. And then the extra that also came with was this little adorable chicken. It's an adorable little pink blush. Well, it's cheeks, it's an adorable little yellow, pale yellow. Pretty undamaged, it's a little spot on the back of its head, bit of dirt, bit of grit. Little pink magnet, oh, very cute. Its head is like coming off half of its body. You can see it's like a um, peg. But it's really, really cute. I do have one chicken. It's kind of cute to have another one in my collection without even want, like buying one specifically. But yeah, it's so cute. Oh my god! <laughs> Let's just push it to the back so it never be soulless. Okay, and I will start with my pets. So I will start with my collection of tabbies. Yes, I got about four tabbies, and uh, yeah. So this is my first tabby. I'll just move these guys out of the way. Thank you. This is my first tabby. Uh, he's an adorable uh, yellow, lemon yellow colour. He's got green eyes, pink nose, and pink little paw pads. And he's really adorable. They're really like the gradient of yellow on his body, which you can kind of see, and on his ears and stuff. And um, he's just really, really adorable. He's a bit dirty. Quite dirty, actually. Um, um, just on the back of his head and stuff. Most of these pets were, but we're not too bad. He's going to clean them up. And um, he's got a pink magnet, and he does have this ink stain on the bottom. I was aware of that when I bought him, but... I didn't care because he was so cute. So, uh, yeah. 
I thought it was just that goddamn adorable. So that was him. Um, and then mine, to add to my small yet still growing crocodile collection, I have this beauty. Now I see this one as a boy. Um, he's a little cutie. He's a they're very adorable, and to me he reminds me a lot of Floss. Like, basically they're the same. Like, basically. Um, so, instead, he has purple eyes. Like, lilac. Basically the same colour of eyes as lilac. But a little bit darker purple. Kind of the same, believe. So, fine, they're the same, whatever. Um, he's got the same yellow chest as Floss. She, she. He is a light green coloured with a little bit of adorable yellow, um, gradient on his alligator mouth or crocodile um then he's got a purple spotting down the back lps symbol on the back of his leg right on his tummy in the black he's not a special edition pet clearly like flosses but you can move away now floss he's still very very cute he does have a little bit of marking on oh where did i see it oh i think it's just on his chin there it's a little hard to see um on camera but other than that oh, a little bit of a dirt mark on the back of his head a bit of orange scratch but other than that he looks pretty darn fine i must say so happy with me, so cute. So the next pet that I got was this adorable grey and white tabby. You probably might know that it comes with another tabby with this pour up. This is this one that was with it. Um, I'm playing a game with the pour up, but I haven't yet. Um, it's he's a white colour with like grey gradient, very similar to the yellow one like before. He's got blue eyes, and literally the unique thing of him is his entire eye is blue, even the white bit is just a really pale blue, which I think is really cool. Um, he has a pink nose, pink paw pads, and a completely grey tail, but it sort of gradients into his body and his ears. So, um, yeah, and he's, he's pretty dirty, he's got a little mark there, um, he's quite dirty on the back. These pets are extremely dirty, I didn't realise that, but, um, regardless, they are adorable, and, um, yeah, he's so cute. I love him. Yay! I think the next one I got from my set of eight was this adorable, adorable crouching cat. She is, like... Oh my god! <laughs> She's like one of the ones of the Crash Cats I've always wanted. Like, I saw her on eBay from an Australian seller um, for a uh, more expensive price, but I've never seen this type before. And I was like, is this like a um, aftermarket pet? But then I sort of Googled Brown and it's actually real. And I never knew it existed. I was like, whoa! Um, she is a light orange colour, so very pale with pink accents in her ears, light green and dark green eyes, little pink nose. Dark brown paws, tail and chest, which I think is so adorable. She's very, very plain, a very, very plain cat. She's pretty, she's actually pretty clean, to be honest. Um, she's got a little bit of markings just on her fur there. I don't know if you can see that on camera, but she's got a little bit there. Not too much. Um, other than that, she's pretty darn fine. Has a whole, yeah, she's super cute. Super happy with her. So the next pet that I got was this adorable little tiger tabby. And yes, as I said, I have four tabbies, so be prepared for another one. Um, he's an adorable orange colour, which like a dark orange with like a sort of a yellow highlight within his ears, down his muzzle on his, and on his chest. Um, he also has stripes on the back of his head, by his cheeks, on his back and throughout his body. And it's really adorable. He's with dark paw pads with lime green eyes, his little pink nose as well. Um, he's really cute. Uh, he has no magnet and he's authentic, obviously. And I just thought he was super adorable and I'm planning on getting the cheetah one as well of these guys. So kind of got like a leopard and not a leopard. A cheetah and a tiger. Yeah. But um I just thought he was really adorable when I got him and yeah, and he's surprisingly clean. Yeah, compared to the other pets. Either that or because of the dark colour you can't see it. Either way, it's adorable and um yeah, I love him. He's so cute! And actually now I have three boys. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> yeah, way. So the next one I got was this adorable adorable bull terrier now as you know from previous well one of our previous videos i think it was another unboxing video where we got floss and lilac from memory um i have jasper which is a bull terrier like this one this little girl and i also have another one um he's like a little sitting down black and white with a diary terrier. yeah part of a diary kind of set thing so i also have him and now i have her and she is so adorable i have seen her around on ebay a little bit not too much but she's very very hard to get for a good price Got a lot of them overseas, and when I saw her for like twelve dollars, I was like, "Why not get her?" And like, I was so happy I did. She's in very, very good condition, to say the least. Pretty clean. She's got a little bit of scuff mark, Oops. just there on her neck. She's like a dark purple colour, like a dark lavender, I would say. White muzzle that recedes down to her chest. Beautiful blue eyes, ocean blue eyes with a little pink LPS symbol on her back leg, back left leg. And uh, yeah, I'm super happy with her. She's so cute. And I can't wait to add her to my growing Bull Terrier collection. Yay! Goodbye! <laughs>
And so the next one that I got was this adorable, adorable uh, messy tabby cat, which is what I call it, the messy tabby. And I think she's absolutely gorgeous. Like, look at her. Like, she's so cute. I just love all the intricate designs and stuff. And I really want the um, short hair one of this that came with this one so badly. She's just as cute. I so wish I got the cat when I was um, younger when they were actually in stores. But um, I'm so glad I have her to add to my tabby collection. Um, she's a dark grey colour with like a light skin colour, I guess you would say, in her, in her ears. Um, blue paint splodges all over her body. She has lighter grey accents on her, like, her chest and her paws and tail um, and on her hair. And she also has little skin colour pink paw pads and beautiful green eyes with that really cool messy splodge in her eyes as her pupils, I guess. Um, and she's just so adorable and super cute and I've really wanted her for quite a long time and I'm so glad to have her in my collection and I'm planning on getting the short hair next. Yay! So, um, yeah, that's her and she's so cute and yeah, I'm just blabbering now. Okay, <laughs> goodbye. Okay, so the fifth one I got was this adorable, adorable husky. She is amazingly adorable and I love her so very, very much. She reminds me a lot of, well, the dark blue one with some with the teardrop and some with the circular eyes, teardrop eyes and stuff. She's clearly a little damaged on her eye, just on her right eye there, on the pupil, but I don't really mind. Other than that, she's pretty good in the way of quality. Her adorable colour is just amazing. I love how she's like a dark, like a dark, <laughs> Ew, <disgusting. laughs> uh, a pale blue colour. It's kind of like a baby blue with the red, the sort of bright red LPS symbol. She's got like a creamy white, uh, yeah, it's like a cream colour, I guess, a creamy white that goes from her face down to her chest with beautiful brown eyes and you don't see them like ever on LPS so I'm so glad I got her with the brown eyes I think you can get her any other way but whatever but with the brown eyes look so cute on her and it just reminds me of like a real husky like a husky dog kind of thing so so happy with that yay either way and so the next pet that I have is this adorable adorable Janet Shepherd isn't she so cute yay um I'm sorry I've wanted this Janet Shepherd for quite some time this is my favourite of this kind of style there is three others. So there's like one that I already have which is like a really light one I named her London and then there's two others there's like a brown there's sort of like brown ones with different sort of eye colours but yeah this one's so adorable I've wanted it for so long I've seen it on the listing for quite some time and I'm like hey let's get it for Christmas because why not Christmas spirit um <laughs> so really her colour is kind of bland it's like a yellow or a pale yellow colour with like dark red kind of dark red purple accents like on her ear flowery design around her eye on like her right paw, front paw and the left back paw and then on the tip of her tail she has like light blue eyes the diamond people um and i absolutely love the lash design on her it's so unique and so cool i just thought it was absolutely adorable in the german shepherds um she has a blue magnet i think she does have a bit of a tilt but i'm not sure she's kind of like a... <laughs> i don't know i don't care but she's so cute this is my is this my eighth i think so my eighth german shepherd i think or ninth eighth or ninth but yeah i'm so glad i have her yeah The next one I got was this, this adorable husky. Now she is one of the, I guess you could say the mother huskies. So she's the one that has a little puppy husky that sort of fits with her colouring. She's definitely, I would say, the best quality one out of the whole set we got. Like she has no markings on her whatsoever. So she is an, an amazing quality and is like not dirty at all. So it looks like she's sort of just been sitting on someone's shelf for quite some time. She's very similar in colouring to the previous husky that I showed with the same Similar blue, but this one's a little bit darker, but it's still got the same sort of creamy accent, so like little eyebrows, which is so cute. Like, <laughs> why not put eyebrows? And so she's got a lot more of that paley colour, so it goes like on her stomach and on her tail and paws and on her face, you know, ears and stuff. She's very, very cute. I don't actually own the husky puppy, I don't own any of the husky puppies, I only just actually have the huskies, which is sad, but I am thinking of getting the husky puppies at some point of my life. Um, I do have another of the mother ones, it's the one that's the mum to the smally orangey coloured husky puppy, if you know what I mean. So she looks in similar design to this one, I don't have her right now, so, but, uh, <laughs> but yeah, just google her if you don't know, or if you do, good on you. <laughs> anyway, uh, goodbye. Now this pet that I'm going to show you next is one that probably most of you might have, I never have, rip. Um, most of you probably have from like collecting her singularly or in the game and it is this short hair. Oh my god you do not understand how long I've wanted this cat. I'm not even kidding you. <laughs> it's been so long, okay? She's like literally my favourite short hair. Literally. I'm sorry I don't <laughs> But oh my god you do not understand how long I've wanted it. You've probably seen this one. If you haven't, where have you been? <laughs> where have you been? But of 
I've always wanted this one so badly. I've seen people have her and like people selling it. I'm like, why would you sell? <laughs> I'll take it. Um, but the reason why I absolutely love her is because she looks like a Siamese. Like the cat, the literal Siamese cat, because of the dark aspects, aspects? accents on her face, like the gradient on her muzzle and her ears. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah, and um, as well with the um, blue in the eyes, like how most Siamese have that really beautiful blue, like, I don't know if you call that ice blue kind of thing, or ocean blue, it's like a really beautiful blue, and this is what this cat has, which that's why I just absolutely love her, because she looks so much like a Siamese, and that's like my favourite cat breed ever. I've never had a Siamese cat, okay, but they're adorable. Um, and she's just so cute, there's not much I can say like about Scottish it. Fold. Scottish Fold. Scottish Fold's cats all the way! No, 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 Siamese. Look how adorable they are. But um, yeah, it's because they got made into a LPS, bruh. Roast it. Yeah, that's an easier thing. <laughs> um, and she is authentic. She has a blue magnet, clear neck peg, and she is so cute. And okay, I'll stop ranting, but this is the best short hair. Don't ever sell it. If you sell this short hair, I will murder you. Thank you. <laughs> so the third one, well, third to last, I should say, is this adorable short hair cat. And yes, I know she is damaged. I didn't know, but I know now. No, now. I know now. I don't know. I, I don't know. <laughs> But yeah, she is extremely damaged. So she's got like the red mark on her face. Her nose is a bit rubbed off. She's got, do you see that? See the H? See that? No. <laughs> that and then the paint bit on her tail there. I didn't realize this in the pictures. I said I knew about this marking here. I just didn't know about this marking here. That's the more because the one on the face you can most likely get yeah, off. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can get this marking off. That's why I got her, but I didn't realize this bit at the back here. Yeah. So it's not too bad anyway. When you're holding her, like, it covers it anyway. Yeah, it's, you know not, I mean? it's not too bad. And I might be able to get it off, who knows, but I can't really get it off. It's, it's quite light anyway, so it's not too noticeable. Nah, not really. But. Anyway, she's super cute. She's not my favorite short hair. I missed out. <laughs> but oh, she is yeah. really, really cute. I've really wanted her. And as well, with, um, with, I've. Well, we, I guess, have gotten the um, purple panda that goes, panda, polar bear that goes with this sort of style with the curl. Yeah, which we got that from an extra in a previous video. Go check it out. I don't think we have that video on YouTube. I like <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, we tell you that. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Uh, don't go check it out. Just dream. Just dream about Please it. Please dream. Um, so, her eyelashes are a bit rubbed off, but it's okay. I have wanted her for a little while. Like, when I saw her and seen people, I saw, I've seen one person use her in videos. I'm like, why not use her more? She's so cute. And I feel like she could go. Oh, like for a lot, um, for, for like if you want to pick an LPS that represents you for blonde hair people, I just sort of see her with the yellow kind of thing, the banana yellow, banana, which is super cute. And uh, yeah, so this is her. Goodbye, Chanel. <sighs> now, <laughs> you ready for some Carly's? Yes, I lied. I mean, I didn't like that, but the truth. But this is the first Carly that I got, which is this one. Yes, it's the red Carly, which I have wanted for so long. I have an aftermarket version of her. And it, I was kind of disappointed with it because I didn't use her much because her head was so spinny. It was like, it's not even usable. But when I saw this collie from the seller for like such a cheap, 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 cheap price, I was like, mine. And um, you probably can tell she's a thing just by looking at her. She's got the shine in her eyes and her blue eyes with the, the gradient on her cheeks, which is definitely a big telltale sign, which I find when it's authentic, is the gradient on the cheeks. And as well, I don't know if you can really tell, but the chest fur, there's actually like red coming through it. Like it's slightly tinted red. I don't, you can't really tell, but it's slightly tinted red. You can sort of just see here, it's like that kind of thing. Tinted red in it. Um, yeah, she has grey down her back, a little white down her tail, and on her back paws. Um, she's a little bit damaged here. I obviously didn't know that. Um, dirty, but regardless, she is adorable and I wouldn't change it for the world. So, um, yeah. I absolutely love her. I know her name, because I named the other one. It's Luna. Yay! Oh, she's just so cute, guys. Well, wait till you see my dream pet. You just bastard. <laughs> 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 Sorry. So, second to last pet. I'm done. Was this adorable short hair? Look at her on camera. She's so gorgeous. You're gorgeous. I know. Yeah. But this is the LPS that I'm thinking of changing to my mascot. Changing from my mascot. From Lassie Girl here. Because I feel that she represents me a lot more. Because, well, for a start, her fur is sort of like my blonde hair. I don't have blonde hair. But I don't have brown hair either, so it's sort of like, I don't know what it is, okay? It's something. But then I have like bleach blonde highlights, which I sort of see is this sort of pattern that she has throughout her body. So, do I see her as my mascot, as well as the green eyes, which is my favourite colour. I don't have green eyes, I have blue. So. Sorry to disappoint y'all. <laughs> y'all. Um, from Texas. Uh, from Texas, and she is authentic. She has a blue magnet, clearly, and she has there's her writing, neat proof, which you don't. Uh, she has a little bit of rust there, kind of, slightly. 
Only a little bit, not too bad. Should be able to clean it up. She doesn't really, she's pretty dirty. She doesn't really have any marks, like her head, you can't like, oh, I don't know. It seems dirt slightly, but it's really dirty in real life. She's got a bit of paint smear there, but other than that, she is in gorgeous condition. I'm so glad I got her. It's so hard to find her on the internet these days. Like, there's so many um, aftermarket There's so many aftermarket versions of her. And it's like so hard to get the genuine versions these days. So it's like when you're looking for them, it's like they're never there. It's like, why? Well, they're really, really expensive. So, yeah, that's her. This is my dream pet. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, I don't know what to say, she's so gorgeous. <laughs> okay, yeah, so this is my dream pet. It's the puzzle Carly, the brown puzzle Carly. There's only one Carly, brown. Oh, fuck. Sugar, sugar. Um, and I am thinking of making her my new mascot from Lilac. Yeah, because I see her more as me than Lilac, even though purple is my favorite color, but I absolutely love Border Collies as well. They're like one of my favorite dog breeds, besides Jimmy Shepherds. Um, and I love dark colours, like blacks and black, yeah, black. Um, and this just represented a Border Collie so close to me because of the dark colours, and Border Collies are obviously black and white. Um, she's got the brown and then the white on her face and on her chest, on her back paws and up her butt to her tail. And she's got the purple eyes, which is my favourite colour. So it basically all just blends to be more like me. I just see her more as me, even though obviously this is, you know, one of the top five and yeah, but I don't care. She's adorable. She is authentic. She had a little bit of a scuff mark there and stuff, but I can clean it up. It's more dirt, really. Scuff, but yeah, she's authentic. She had a pink magnet. See that? It's pink. <laughs> kind of jealous? <laughs> no, not really. But I don't know. But it's a pink magnet. She's authentic. You can see the writing. It's kind of upside down. Read it upside down. Please don't have to read it upside down. Put it in the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, I absolutely love her. She's in really good condition for her. She's just got a really spinny head. For some reason. Yep, it's not spinning. Great. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, I'm tr yeah. Trust me, it's a spinny head, but she's absolutely adorable, and <gasps> I can't wait to use in future videos. <coughs> and, and her name's Eclipse. Yeah, it's a cool name, I know. <laughs> so, the last pet I got was this adorable Collie. Look at her on camera, she's so gorgeous. She looks so cute. She looks so cute. She is genuine, you can see the shine in her eyes as she looks up into the distance, thinking of her boyfriend. Um, so, this is her, she is Collie 2210 because I know that off my heart, because I looked for her everywhere, to be honest. Um, she, I love her pattern, to be honest, like her dark brown accents that run up her face, to her ears, and then to the fluffs on her face, as well as through her body, throughout her body kind of thing, which I think looks really, really cool. I do have an aftermarket version of her, which has like her, this paint kind of like flicked off to this side kind of thing, which is adorable AF. And uh, this is the boyfriend, by the way. It's a cute. <laughs> yeah, he's a cute. He is alpha market. Just yeah. Letting you know, she is not now. Um, she does have a bit of rust on her neck. I don't know if you can see it. She has it on her neck peg, which I can't get off. Which, well, which I won't be able to get off. I mean, because I haven't actually tried. Um, other, than, well, she's got a little cut and scratch up here by her ear. A bit of markings here. A bit here. There's a bit of on the top of her ear. There, a bit of paint sort of smeared off. But she's not too bad. Oh no, she's not too bad. She did. Oh, she does have a little bit of like. I don't think you can't really see it on camera, but there's like a little bit of um, plastic sort of chipping underneath her chin. Other than that, for the price that I got her for, it's amazing. She is amazing. Her name's Yukino, too, by the way. So, yeah, and this is her boyfriend, Akira. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, that was our LPS Christmas haul. Yeah, and um, we decided to start using our new mascots now because why not just end this awesome video with awesome mascots? And we wish you. Us from us two here at LPS Aki Unit, we wish you all a Merry Christmas and safe holidays, as well as Happy New Year. Unless yes. we do a video beforehand. But Happy New Year anyway. Yay! Happy New Year to you guys, and uh, please comment, subscribe, and give it a like if you enjoyed. And if you'd like to see more of these, because we're going to do them anyway. Yeah, regardless, because we enjoy doing them, and yeah, they're just fun to do. And as we said, well, we didn't say, but this is from our money. Well, we said that, but we. This is also no way to brag no. either. Like we, this is for Christmas, and I feel like, well, for Christmas you always get presents, and this is what we decided to get our presents for. LPS. Yes, and we in nowhere were bragging with, especially these guys, like and the short hairs and collies at all we just saw them at a good price and i guess we were just lucky to snag them up before anyone else did so please don't think we're bragging at all mm -mm. 
like that's not what we're trying to do here i've waited so long to get this collie and we um, just, yeah well, we just really just wanted to share our excitement with you guys like first on hand yeah. we hadn't looked at them at all prior or anything as you saw we actually unboxed it on camera yeah. and we're just showing our true reactions of what we see like when you see something this beautiful or like me and you know how you react to it when it's a dream lps yeah so yeah that's all from lps akidino so like subscribe and mm -hmm. comment down below of what you think and thanks for watching bye guys bye. In the ACL, that's my homeboy. Watch your back if you're gonna walk alone, boy. Cause everybody in the homeboys trying to get rich. You could get hit even if you're known, boy. Uh, we the kings of the south. Pies in the oven, grills in the mouths. Count stacks is a usual norm. College Park Bank here where the hustle was born. So peace up and A Town down. 4-4 living with the 808 sound. Nightlife popping, ain't nobody stopping. Cutting up a rub when the beat drop, dropping. The dirty birds nest here, and then the haters get to talking. Then they falling on the deaf ears. This is where trap music was born on the 50 yard line of the Georgia Dome in the ATL. Pop that, drop that, dirty birds, you ain't never gonna stop that. ATL. We the best, this dirty south, living from MIA to Texas. ATL. Drop stacks in the tip cup, buying out the bar at the strip club. ATL. GA all day, let me show you how we living down south in the ATL. Thank you.